So we're going to do an unboxing of the USRP package that we ended up getting from uh, Edis in the last couple days here. So it comes with some instructions. We've already opened this up, so that's why it looks a little bit uh, kind of disorganized on top there. But it comes with a couple uh, do's and don'ts uh, for what you should expect uh, to uh, have to do when using the USRP. Of, uh, original packaging and this is one unit these four antennas we ordered uh, separately they're specifically made uh, for the USRP USB cable to go to the uh, PC or server that we're going to be using this one is just the power supply so it can it has all the adapters if it if you're going to be uh, using it in a different country here and the DC component okay yeah no Edis was definitely thinking when they made this just pull this whole machine out of here. And we have a second as we are planning to have uh, two OpenBTS implementations set up. So this box has all of the parts for mounting the USRP um, electronics inside of the casing. And so there's the standoffs, there's the actual um, cables, uh, RF cables for inside of the device, and the fan. So you can just kind of pop that fan right in. And the USRP. That it does. So we got the uh, basically four empty holes that you can uh, pop in because uh, each uh, the USRP can do uh, four separate uh, um, kind of RF modules on it. It has a USB input in the front and the actual power as well. Um, I think only the front is has the actual uh, uh, connections going out of it here. So we have already uh, just kind of thrown the uh, daughter boards onto the USRP device. And so I'll just take that out of the package in here. Ian, did you want to take that out for me? Yeah, sure. Just uh, make sure that you only touch the sides of them. Yeah. Okay. So, this is the USRP with two daughter boards attached. So these are the uh, RFX 900 daughter boards, as it says right up there in the corner, if it will focus. There it goes. So Flex 900 is the type of board that we got. has the TXRX port and just the uh, RX2. And so each one of these has uh, two kind of uh, plugs that it, on the, it connects in two different places on the uh, USRP. And we'll be using one of these boards for transmit, one for receive. And there is the DC power and the USB for the computer. And right here is where we're going to have to insert our own custom clocks because the actual USRP itself does not uh, clock accurately enough to be used with GSM. So that's what uh, we're going to be working on uh, first thing with uh, uh, Eugene here. And all in all, it is one very impressive piece of hardware. I am going to be quite excited to work with this.